it a punch to get the guard. And Porters came round her by the score. And she told them all she'd never had a ticket punch before. Today, we're gonna try and make evolution give up completely. Life created DNA, otherwise known as the stuff you don't want to leave behind at a crime scene, which leads to the much more popular sexual reproduction. You're welcome, idiots. Do stuff. Turn into a creature. Turn into a muscle. Anything at all, please. Maybe they do need to eat. I don't know if I love the way they seem to produce oxygen because that's conducive to life thriving, but we'll let them get away with it for now. They somehow will one day be the dominant force on my planet, but that's also not saying very much. That would be okay if we could microwave evolution and can we get some fun results? Are you ready to trigger the extinction event? Yes, no questions asked. All things must come to an end, especially if I'm in control of them. I am the very model of a modern nature general. I've information, vegetable, animal, and mineral. I know the kings of England and I quote the fights historical from Marathon to Waterloo in order categorical. I am very well acquainted too with matters mathematical. I understand equations both the simple and quadratical about binomial theorems and teeming with a lot of news. <laughs> lot of news. <laughs> With many cheerful facts about the square of the hypotenuse. Every day, the same old thing. Same old heavy hammer that I go swing. Massive throbbing in my brain. And it's dry, 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 in me insane. When I got back to the grubber house the next morning, the first thing I noticed was the new door. The new door was fantastic. It was twice as high as the other one had been, and it looked ridiculous. I couldn't begin to imagine who would want a tremendous tall door like that in his house, unless it was a giant. I tried to catch some sign or sound of movement inside the house, but there was none. Come on, Richie. Let me out of my sex typhoon. Hello, baby. Heavy, heavy. <laughs> Calm down. That's a chair. Yeah. It's a bit of all right, isn't it? Have me. I'm a love albatross. Oh, you smell great. <laughs> Let's do it. Changed your mind, have you, dearie? Well, come on, then. Plant a big one right on me, kisser. Uh, hey, here's a good one. Anyone fancy a quick gander at the Eiffel Tower?